Hey there, everybody. It is Leland the Realtor, and it's time for your Monday market update. Now, last week, we saw 369 new homes come onto the market and 83 homes come back on the market because they were previously under contract. Now, the number of back on market deals is actually relatively low, lower than what I was expecting. But that brings the total number of homes available on the market this week or newly available homes to 452 homes in the last seven days. Now, on top of that, we actually saw a surge of buyers with 435 of those homes going under contract. So we saw probably more buyers than I've ever had on any of these Monday market updates at 435. That's quite a few. Now, with the average contract taking about four to five weeks to complete, or rather 30 days, I should say, we saw 263 homes close, and four weeks ago, we saw 370 homes go under contract. So now what we're starting to see is my initial numbers whenever I was calculating fall through rate, rate was not incredibly accurate because of the data that I had back then. But now that I have weekly data, it's looking like it's closer to one in four transactions fall through as opposed to one in 5.6 or 5.7. So we'll throw out the numbers at a, at a later time when I have more data but we are seeing a very strong market. We are continuing to see that. Now, yesterday I saw 1,922 homes available, which is amongst the lowest that I've ever seen. Anytime it's below 2,000 homes, that is just critically low inventory. And that is why we're seeing a lot of the new listings immediately sell because there just isn't a whole lot of homes available. Now, that being said, we did see 155 homes lower their prices in the last seven days as well, because we are are seeing a lot of people pricing their homes initially high to see if they can get a little bit more for their home. I hope you found this information useful. If you did, please share with your family and friends. I am Leland the Realtor, keeping real estate simple. Have a wonderful day.